Purnima Kamble. I'm a lawyer with a firm called Fox Mandel uh, and Associates LLP. Uh, we are an all India firm, one of the leading firms of the country, and we help a lot of startups and investors in, at both ends to sort of connect with one another from a legal perspective if there's a diligence to be done, investments to be made. Uh, getting the startups in order and ensuring that they are compliant with law, all that we help them. Now, when it comes to this particular event, I'm here wearing a very different cap. I'm here as the CII India Women Network uh, Chairwoman for this year. I'm, I'm um, you know, the year 21-22. And um, why am I here? For two reasons. A, to s sort of you know, encourage the partnership within the ecosystem. So IWIN and TAI have signed up an MOU and we are encouraging more such organizations to come together and have this sort of connection amongst ourselves where we can then help more women entrepreneurs, you know. So when we talk about public-private partnership, I say private-private partnership is also very important, which is what brings us here. Now the second thing, me as an investor, this is a fantastic event. Um, the kind of, uh, the quality of the pitches made are exceptional. And um, as an investor, I think it's very important to get women to speak about their product. Women generally are shy by nature. And uh, you know, they may be doing great work, but if they don't have the platform to speak, then all that work really doesn't help. And therefore, events like these are very important. For me, this has been a great takeaway. I definitely am looking at a couple of pitches that have been made here as an investor. Hi, I'm Zaran from Antel Ventures. We're a venture capital fund based in Singapore and India. And today's been a fantastic session for us. We did not know what to expect. We just came to see some fantastic businesses. And what blew us away was the amazing range. Uh, we saw tungsten metal, we saw fintech, we saw consumer brands. and. What's amazing is as the years go by, we're seeing better and better businesses and we're very excited to see more events such as this. It's a phenomenal experience there. Absolutely. I think this is a great example of the ability Indian entrepreneurs have and especially Indian women entrepreneurs. We often hear that not a lot of investments are going towards women entrepreneurs because maybe there are not so many. This event is proof that there is no pipeline problem. We have phenomenal business opportunities out and it is our job as investors to ensure that we're giving equal access to capital distribution to our amazing women entrepreneurs as well. Uh, well, that remains to be seen. There were a couple of pitches that we've requested meetings for, especially one in the fintech domain, uh, which falls within our thesis of consumer enablement. Uh, we will be able to announce something very soon. Yeah. Hey, hi, good morning. Uh, my name is Hema Srinivas. I'm an independent uh, trainer, consultant and coach. I deal with uh, leadership and capability development. And I'm an associate member at uh, Thai Hyderabad. I'm also, I have a dual role. I'm also a member of CII's Indian Women Network. Now why I find these platforms so interesting is uh, women have ideas, not only women, entrepreneurs have ideas, but it is platforms like these which give you that scaffolding to build your business. So as much support as we can give in terms of uh, these ecosystems, I think that's where uh, uh, these collaborations really pay out. So um, forums like this is what uh, women entrepreneurs especially should leverage so that they can speak to the world, they can talk about their ideas, they can build their confidence and as many pitches as you can do, it helps in terms of uh, ultimately reaching out and building your business. So that's why these, these platforms interest me and I think it's a long, it is time that all these forums come together and build that partnership so that ultimately we can serve that entire ecosystem of uh, building women entrepreneurs and entrepreneurs at large. So thank you.